Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Today another update on this single phase generator setup of mine. Um, I've already done the tests, so to keep the video as short as possible. What I've done is uh, kind of the same as before. I did a uh, open system test with uh, no load. It is running at uh, 1711 RPM with one watt load, this light bulb it is running at 1705 so there's a drop of 6 rpm if I short the DC output which is this one here it goes to 1718 so that is a increase of 7 rpm if I use this one farad large capacitor on the output uh, it will go around 698 which is a decrease of 13 rpm less and if I put it to the system like it is now the output rectified back to the system as you can see it is running at 70 on and 2 so that is compared to the open rpm is 9 rpm less which is pretty good and also in this case normally I would have these two coils in series I put them in parallel so I have uh, less voltage and more amps or milliamps I uh, got the same magnets on the core the alloy, uh, alloy 50 so I will write this in the comment section so uh, you guys can uh, and girls can look at it um, this is the last test on this setup for now as you can see over here I have more of these cores I've tested them already but uh, because I have 12 coils and uh, 12 pole rotor, the cogging is uh, very bad, very massive. That's not going to work. But uh, I don't have 12 core, I have only 18. Sorry, I don't have 24 cores, only 18. So it's going to be 9 on each side. So I'm going to go and make another generator with 9 coils on each side. 9 here and 9 there. And that way I will only have three corals and three cores at a time uh, aligned with three magnets. So I done that before in another video and doing that that way the cogging effect is uh, far less. So that will be a bit more interesting. Um, I will hopefully have it done in like yeah one or two weeks. And the system is now running at yeah let's say 15 volts 15 and a half at 600 uh, yeah just above 600 milliamps which is not bad at all with all these scores in place nine on each side it was pulling around uh, one and a half to two amps which is way too much don't like that i need to keep it down the one amp and by going with nine coils on each side i'm pretty sure it will be down below one amp at this kind of speed and the rpm now as you can as you already heard of my uh, notation uh, is around say 1700 so it's not bad and as you see the output is going to the source and it helped it a little bit if I disconnect it you won't see it because it is a 3 amp meter scale but yeah it is a little bit more now and when I connect it, it's a little bit less. So, one side of coil definitely helped. Anyway, uh, stay tuned. Within a week or so, I will have it done. And we'll continue with this setup. Um, once more, I will write this information in the comment section. So you um, hope you enjoyed it. And as always, thank you for watching.